Shruti, it's already 9.30. Hurry up. Dr. Sarika will be here any moment. Don't worry, ma'am. We have still half an hour. Only half an hour. And get me some fresh flowers. Our clients will be here any moment. I'll just go. Good morning, Dr. Sarika. Good morning, Kavita. Is Mrs. Sharma coming in for her treatment today? Uh, yes, ma'am. Okay. <laughs> Oh, hi. I'm Kavita. I work here at Mehek Skin Clinic as a cosmetic therapist. She's Dr. Sarika, our senior professional. Do you know, she performs all the cosmetic procedures on the clients all by herself. I get to assist her sometimes. This is Dr. Sarika's room. She consults her clients and discusses all the important procedures with them in this room. Kavita, you did an excellent job of assisting me with the peel procedure yesterday. You're learning fast. Thank you, ma'am. Keep it up. The clinic also has other rooms to carry out different procedures and treatments. Come, let me show you around. After completing this session, you will be able to list the different areas of the workplace, explain the specific requirements of the rooms. Area. Shruti and I fix the appointments with all our clients in this room. Usually a large clinic has a dedicated receptionist. But here at Mehek Skin Clinic, Shruti and I perform the duties of a receptionist together. This is a laptop. We have the database for all our clients and the case histories in this laptop. Hi Kavita ma'am. Hi Shruti. See I got these lovely flowers for the reception. And I'm very sure they look very pretty here. Of course. Oh no, I broke the vase. Look at the mess I have created. It's already 9.45. The clients will be coming any moment. And the room looks so dull and bare without these flowers. Shruti, relax. Accidents happen. Just go get the cleaner lady. Tell her to come here with a mop and broom, okay? Now just go to the supply room and check the middle shelf. You'll find an extra vase there, okay? Yeah. <laughs> Lucky BB had a spare vase. Shruti, luck had nothing to do with this. To ensure that we always have spare materials available with us is also a part of running a clinic. You know, this vase was kept there only for such emergency situations. These flowers add just the right amount of colour to the room, don't they? <laughs> so friends, you just saw how unforeseen circumstances can take place in a clinic. The key here is to remain calm. Also, a bit of planning can save the day. So you should always ensure that you have spare materials and sufficient stock available with you all the time. The reception is my favourite area in the entire clinic. It looks so bright and colourful. Just have a look at the seating area. It looks so comfortable. The clients can easily sit and relax and go through the latest magazines while they wait for their turn. So friends, always remember, this is an aesthetic clinic, not a routine doctor's clinic. Cheerful, comfortable and colourful surroundings always add to an individual's self-esteem. And that is why it is so important that the reception should be so warm and welcoming. This is Dr. Sarika, our senior professional's room. This is where Dr. Sarika consults her clients. This is where the client sits. I'm sure you're wondering what these are. This is the hand lens. And this is the dermascope. Both of these are used to analyze the skin. Ma'am? Yes? Here is the list of appointments for today. Okay. 
Dr. Sarika decides the procedure required for each client, but before that, she has to go through the case history of each client. Kavita, Mr. Arun is coming in for second round of his microdermabrasion treatment. He has highly sensitive skin. So make sure I inspect the treatment area before you start his next session, okay? Sure. Yeah. Once Dr. Sarika has decided the procedure, she instructs me on how to proceed. So you see, the senior professional's room is a consultation room. This is where the client and the senior professional discuss all the possible treatments and I get my instructions. This is the changing room. We provide gowns for clients to wear before the treatment. Once the treatment is over, the clients come back to this room and remove the gown. And here it is, the therapy room. Come, let's go inside. Ah, this is where I work magic on people's skin. When the clients enter, they first keep their belongings in the basket there. Just look around the room. It has dim lighting. This is because this room is meant to completely soothe and relax the client. So you will not find any bright lighting in this room except this lamp. We use this lamp to focus light on the specific area that needs to be treated. Also, this room has an excellent collection of instrumental music. Playing soft melodies when the client is being treated really helps to soothe the client. Let's have a look at the trolley. The trolley should have all the materials and equipments required for the treatment. I take special care that the trolley should always be correctly stocked. So friends, now you know that a successful treatment room is the one which always completely and immediately relaxes the client. The room should be cleaned and made ready for the client first thing in the morning because the clients can come anytime and we should always be prepared. Oh gosh, just have a look at the time. I should quickly tidy up the room. Oh God, just have a look at the dust. This room gets dirty so quickly. Hmm, now it's fine. These sheets are so dirty and crinkled. Hmm, these look neat and crisp. Perfect. No creases. The room already looks so fresh. Hmm. The smell of lavender and cinnamon. It already feels so heavenly. Let me put on some music. So soft lighting, soothing music. I'm already feeling so relaxed. I just need to check my trolley and then I'm done. The trolley should have all the standard equipments and materials. Let me check from this list if all the materials are there in the trolley. Yes, everything is in place, so the trolley is completely ready. But the cream is a little less, but it's enough for today's massage session. So you can see, the room is neat, clean and fragrant. It has a relaxing atmosphere. The trolley is completely and correctly stocked and this room is now ready to be used. The last room is a very special room. It's called the laser room. 
As you can see, it has restricted access. It is to stop people from entering it when the procedure is going on. That would be very dangerous. This room requires special care as it has the laser machine. It needs to be kept clean all the time. You see the shoe rack here? It has clean footwear. Anyone who has to enter the laser room has to change into clean slippers before entering. I'm now ready to go inside. Come, follow me. It's cold in here. The temperature is kept low because of the laser machine. That one is the laser machine. This here is the chiller machine. It is used to chill the skin. The client lies down on the couch next to the laser machine. They are positioned in a way that the focus light falls right on the treatment area. Let's have a look at the trolley. The trolley is similar to the one in the treatment room, but it has some extra materials, like the eye guard. We place the eye guard on the client's eyes to protect them from the laser light. We too need to protect our eyes from the lasers. You see the protective glasses here? They're special glasses which are needed to protect our eyes from the laser light while we carry out the procedure. The trolley also has skin markers, disposable razors, sunscreen and medicinal creams. So now you know where the laser treatment is carried out. The laser machine is a very expensive piece of equipment and you really need to take extra care of it. All the rules to keep the laser room clean and sterile must be followed at all times. So now you know what the layout of a typical clinic looks like. Here we are back at the reception. When the clients finish their treatment, this is where I give them their parting instructions. It's almost 10 o'clock. The calls will start coming in now. <laughs> See what I mean? I should better take this call. I hope you enjoyed my tour of the clinic. See you later. Good morning, Mehek Skin Clinic. My name is Kavita. How may I help you? This is how a typical aesthetic clinic looks like. Take these quiz questions to check your understanding. I'll see you later.